Ghost of Tsushima is a brand new series for PlayStation, but it's by no means developer Sucker Punch's first game, with classics such as Infamous and Sly Cooper being in their back catalogue. So you're probably wondering, is there any hidden Sucker Punch references on the Isle of Tsushima? Well, not only can Jin cosplay as everyone's favourite raccoon thief, but you also get a lovely hidden trophy for your troubles. It's a little tricky to do though, so here's how. To get the trophy Cooper Clan Cosplayer, you'll need to collect four cosmetic items and one armor die. The first item, the thief wrap, will come naturally as you play, should you be regularly checking in at any gift altar you can find. The second item you'll need to get is Gosaku's armor, which you'll receive by completing the mythic tale, The Unbreakable Gosaku. This involves liberating six farmsteads and earning six keys that allow you to retrieve the armor in Akashima. The third and fourth items are Sly Cooper specific that are hidden in the world. The first one, the Sly Tanuki Sword Kit, can be found at the Pillar of Honor to the right of Hawaii Village in Kamagata. It's right on the edge of the cliff area that is as far east as you can go and is sitting there waiting for you to grab it. The last item is the Crooked Karma Headband and can be found on the tallest building immediately south of the Jakaku Temple entrance in Kamagata. It won't be immediately obvious how to get up, but by positioning yourself in the corner of the building, you can use your grappling hook to reach the top and earn the blue headband with the iconic imagery of Sly Cooper's cane. The last thing that you need to complete the ensemble is the Ocean's Guardian armor die for your Gosaku armor. This can be bought from the merchant at Jakaku Temple, just make sure you have enough flowers handy. Then simply throw the whole outfit together and... Jin is now cosplaying as Sucker Punch's legendary thief. Oh, and remember the trick to climbing the building to retrieve the headband? Well, if you do the same technique of the Omi Monastery, you'll find the Band of the Second Sun, a headband that looks very familiar to a beanie worn by a warrior from a distant time and place. And if you like that video and want to see more about Ghost of Tsushima, why not check this out?